I'm here with Catherine Wilson, one of the organizers of the workshop. So Cassie, can you tell me the goal of the workshop the Company of Biologists is organizing? This workshop was designed to bring together three groups of people who normally hardly even know each other's papers, much less their persons. Um, people who understand evolutionary biology, people who understand the structure of the cell nucleus, and people who understand a lot about a part of the nucleus, the nuclear pore complex, that turns out to have lots of secret lives. The proteins that are part of a pore complex turn out to be very critical for when cells divide. And it was really important to start having these people talk to each other, so that was the goal of this conference. So this sort of conference doesn't exist uh, at the moment? So no, know? completely unique. It was, it was um, when I found out about these, we called them dream meetings, when I found out about it, I was just so happy about the chance to, to pull this group of people together because I had never seen this opportunity before. Mm, that's great. Um, so can you describe a bit the format of the workshop and how the format differs from other meetings that you attend? Oh, the format. Um, first of all, everybody just looks at the place we have this meeting and they, <laughs> if they were like me, they went, wow, and a big sigh because it was so beautiful. <laughs> and you just feel like you're here to think creatively. The format is to have um, two and, in a few cases, three talks and then a nice long coffee break with more so people have really have a chance to discuss what was, what was brought up and the new questions. And so I would say that what's unique about this format is the small-ish number of talks, only about 20, and the really good spacing, chances to meet people during the long coffee breaks to eat with them, to have breakfast, to take mm. walks together, yep. and it's just been fantastic. Oh, that's great. So what do you think the workshop has achieved then? I think it's seriously achieved its goal of, we have evolutionary biologists talking to people who know about nuclear pore complexes and vice versa, and people who, who might have really not understood how their field impacted the other and vice versa, they're seeing that now, and I, I I've been hearing very good feedback oh, about fun. how people's work is being, how their future directions will be affected by yeah, that's these fantastic. discussions. So yeah, following up from that, so, um, so can you tell me how do you think that your research is going to be influenced by this workshop? So you have already some ideas. Oh, yes. Um, I've learned a lot of things. I had some notions come by bringing these people together with my co-organizers. Um, I've learned I had connections I didn't understand before. Someone who's studying um, the primary cilium. I realized one of her proteins is very much like my protein. So that's a whole new direction for my own research on nuclear envelope membrane proteins. And mainly just the reality and the excitement of finally getting to meet people whose papers I've read who are studying the types of eukaryotes, our kinds of cells, but who are so evolutionarily distant from us, I can really get face to face and say, are you looking at this kind of protein? And what, here's what you might find and, and you know, just forging the bonds that, that now make it easy for me to, to talk to them. Hmm. Um, especially important for, for scientists who are maybe a little less extroverted and a little more <laughs> introverted. <laughs> So Tim, as the chairman of the board of directors of the Company of Biologists, so I assume you're familiar with the workshop format. Is this, but is this the first workshop that this you attend? This is the first workshop I've actually attended. I was very keen when the suggestion came to start them because I thought they were a terrific idea. Hmm. So what, what in particular interests you out about the topic of this workshop, mitosis uh, and nuclear well, I, structure? Well, I've, I've always been interested in, 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 in mitosis and its control. So this is... Uh, this is very close to, to home. So, we yeah, haven't said that. So, which aspect of workshop do you find most stimulating? Well, I, I find the, you know, the, the, what interests me is how you flip from these two states, the interphase to mitosis, and how do you actually take apart the nucleus. And there have been relatively few talks about, about that. I, I do mean, like I, discussion when they get absolutely, really, really no, I mean, involved. The discussion is really terrific, and mm -hmm. for, both for clarification and mm -hmm. also for... You know, because it shows that people really care about what they're mm. 
what they're talking about, the, res the results. Now, nothing's worse than when people just sort of listen to each other's talks and it doesn't really matter what they say. They could have said the exact opposite and nobody would bat an eye. <laughs> <laughs> but I mean, there were some good discussions in that they were talking for like 10 or 15 minutes yeah, yeah, and there yeah, was yeah. some going back no, and forth. No, absolutely. And it's been a very broad meeting mm. too. I mean, it was very nice that we had a, uh, what was it, two talks on bacterial mm. uh, division. It was, it was so did you find those interesting? Very, very interesting. Okay, thank you very much for very speaking good. to me. Not at all. So hi, Ralph. Welcome to the Cognitive Biologist Workshop on Mitosis and Nuclear Structure. Petra. <laughs> so uh, what was your reaction to the invitation when you originally received it? I was very happy to get the invitation, of course, uh, because uh, soon I realized that uh, there are many uh, other famous scientists here which are much <laughs> more famous than I am, and I Just thought I could learn something. Oh. So um, can you tell me a bit about uh, what you spoke about at the workshop? I was speaking about a uh, lamin-like protein and dictyostelium, so it, it fitted well to the second part of the title of the workshop with mitosis and nuclear structure, so it was dealing more about nuclear structure. So how do you like the format of the workshop and how does it differ from other meetings that you usually attend? Yeah, first of all, uh, I was surprised that so few people are here, but uh, soon yeah. I realized that it, this is a really very good thing because uh, it is really possible to, to talk to almost anybody here on the meeting and, and I think the discussions in the, in the talks are much more lively than yeah. they are uh, usually the case. So uh, I think it's a, it's, it's a great format. Uh, which needs to be copied, I think. <laughs> <laughs> That's fantastic, yeah. So um, what do you think you will take away from the workshop with regard to your own research? I think several good ideas. So just in the discussion with the other uh, scientists here, I got several uh, good hints uh, with regard to methods and also um, one maybe possibility for collaboration uh, uh, to go on with, um, with our own research and yeah, some new ideas. Yeah, so it was really very good so far. Yeah, that's, that's great to hear. So overall, what do you think has the workshop achieved? I think uh, uh, it brought together uh, two things which are usually represented by different meetings, like my, my toes is a mm -hmm. nuclear structure, but uh, they have uh, very much to do with each other. Yeah. And uh, so I think it was very good to bring these people together and also uh, these uh, evolutionary aspects, which were touched in, in, in many talks here. Uh, were very interesting and, and really connected these talks very well to each other. So I think uh, almost any talk so far, or not, not, not only almost any talk so far, was really, uh, really interesting and, and brought new aspects, which I think were interesting for all the others. You saw this in this lively discussions here. Oh, that's great. Yeah. So thank you very much for speaking to me. You're welcome.